stock up with Terry, but Zone so good at playing defensively, calm and adapting. So it re it's really up to either player to adapt to each other. And we, you know, we can see here how how much this goes back and forth. You know, Zone winning more recently as of late, but Darkstalker, you know, usually gets this. But as we've seen today, Zone is playing hot. 3-0 in Darkstalker in winners finals, but he's here for the run back. And we're going straight to PS2 for game one. And this is kind of important for Darkstalker, right? He needs to see how zone is going to play that mid-range neutral and punish accordingly, because, you know, it just takes one enigmatic flame to be thrown out and, and miss, and then Darkstalker can get a big punish for it. Most definitely. And, you know, during the set, Darkstalker's going to be thinking about that winner's finals, thinking about what he can do differently from them. Does, doesn't want to get free would again. He has to get six games on the board. So we're going to see how he can change up his gameplay. But zone, you know, he's got nothing he needs to change up here. He's playing safe here. Yeah, this guy's Was that, that up <laughs> this guy's just... The beam from the heavens rising from below, but you know, not taking it just yet. Both characters sitting at plus 100% here. And, you know, Zone needs to play real safe here because that go meter is online. Can't let Dark Silver get anything started. Zone trying to go for a grab there. And wow, wow that, that yeah. power, guys. Yeah. I don't know if that was auto turnaround or if we read the roll there, but. Right, Dark you know, mind is something beautiful, man. He, he definitely read that. Yeah. 100% knew that he was going to roll in. That was strong. And now, there we go. the and momentum now, is here. Now he's going to be tacking on as much extra credit as he can, keeping Zone in the corner. But, you know, Zone, you know, he's going to keep that cool head and just deal with whatever's in his way. But, you know, we see the situation before where Darkstalker is in disadvantage and Zone just using his using Palutena's tools to just keep him away and deal with it. But the Darkstalker there, ready to catch the teleport cancel, answers with a Nair into Burning Knuckle, and now he has the stage control and a nice lead. Just, just throwing out these little options to see how Zone reacts. He's got a hit here, Zone, though. See how much he can do for it. 45. Now he's on the ledge again. Zone's been strong on the ledge, but Darkstalker happy to run out and get back into center. Yeah, both of these characters, players trading blows here. And then Darkstalker looking for that auto cancel. Doesn't manage to fish anything just yet. Zone just trying to play as safe as possible. You know, we see him play safe when he has the lead, but when he's behind, you know, he's going to play even more safe than that. Yep. Doesn't want to overextend at all. Gets the power done, but not all of the hit of it. Now we're back in center. Ooh, and he gets him there with the, the landing hit of power dunk. He tries to get that dash attack there at ledge, but zone recovering nicely with that teleport. How does he get out of the corner here, bro? It's zone. Yeah. He's just spacing just so well. So bro. good at using Palu's tools, those aerials, yeah. those tilts, everything to just keep you in the corner. You know, and you know, it, it can make the, the player desperate to get back, and that's where you find the way to punish. But you know, Darkstalker managing to find a way back, has the Govia back online, and Zone using that explosive flame doesn't want Darkstalker getting close at all. Wants to just keep him in disadvantage as much as possible. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it doesn't get the back throw. That's oh, exactly that, what he was fishing that, for. That trade, grab release with the jab there. Oh, and he oh tries to go. What's going on? <laughs> what on what earth doing? is going on? We're seeing a lot of, <laughs> little bit of Tom and Jerry situation here. Well, they were just back pressing and forth. It's hoping for the best, and the up is going to take yeah, the stock. It's going to take Zone's it. Zone's going to be counting his lucky stars for that. <laughs> that Buster Wolf power guys are with him, but Zone unable to punt it. And now Darkstalker answering right back with that raw power dunk taking Zone's stock, and now we're back to zero of both, but Zone getting the damage that he wants to get. See how Zone's able to take this, if he is able to. Tries to go for the down there, and now Darkstalk has got a second lease on life here. Yes, yeah, not over till it's over. May got a percent lead here, but Darkstalk, you know, he's feeling to get those combos. Yeah, I like that landed option. Oh, wow, and that crazy knockback from the crack seat there. But, you no, know, Dark Soul, he's going to run with it. Keep that tech chase going. And not slow scary, down man. at all. You know, with, with, a, with a player like Zone, who plays very patient and accordingly, you know, with Dark Soul. Oh, yeah. and yeah, that's there how they is get down there coming right out. I was going to say, you know, Zone playing so accordingly, you know, Dark Soul, he really wants to find a way to just, you know, put, you know, put, just. Pedal to the metal, just yeah. hit him as hard as he can. But Zone just, you know, so good at just chilling and keeping him in the corner. Well, I can tell you from that one game, that was considerably better than the winners' final. So Darkstalk has figured something out, yeah, which is good. Exactly. I think not, it's, not a steamroll by any margin. No, absolutely not. And I feel like I feel like Darkstalker again. He, he's picking 
He's picking his points a lot more carefully now. He's, he's obviously pressing points. It's still Darkstar. Let's not confuse myself here. <laughs> but he's definitely been a bit more careful. Much more Ramsey. calculated with his aggression. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Back to PS2 yet again for game two. Zone with one game on the board, and you know that's a comfortable place to be in, especially when you're sitting in winner's side. Yeah, you've got so but, much to play with here. No, okay, so much time. It really games. is on Darkstalker to adapt here and find a way to change things up. Shield that's looking real low there. And oh, that's oh, it. that! Oh, and that! Yeah, you know, if you're Darkstalker, that's good news for Bro, you. You're taking that, you're, you're day, taking you're that seven days a week. That crack shoot. Zone, and you, know, you can't be ready for a tech like that. Nah, it's just one can. of those situations. You gotta react as quickly um, as you can. But sometimes you know, if, you can. if you're zone right now, it's just something you just gotta shrug it off. You know, he's, he's, he's you know, no problem playing uh, at deficit. But you know, Darkstalk, he's gonna try and run away with this. 100%. I feel like this is the first time we've seen between these two today where Darkstalker has like a pretty strong, strong lead here. Yeah, this is, this is definitely Changes quite a nice margin again. he has to work with. You know, he's gonna, he's gonna take this, he's gonna keep doing his damage and you know, Zone, you know, you're gonna think about how, how is that wow. gonna change up how Zone plays because you know, usually so calm and collected, but after something like that, you know, he's gonna be, he's gonna be getting a bit more greedy, you know, he wants to close it out. And you know, Darkstalker, you know, you can't be playing aggressive against him because he will shut that down Bro, with his own aggression. Look at this, look and how textbook this is, man. Darkstalker has taken this lead so far. This is looking like a completely different player. That's what I'm saying. You know, when, when Zone's in the lead, he's more than happy to just sit back in the back seat and you know let you know you you know just take just keep doing what he does. But you know, in this sort of situation, you know, Darkstalker, he, he really has the game here. Yeah. But you know, Zone is not out just yet. You may have to deal with free Terry stocks right now, especially with this Go meter online. So but back here, so to connect, yeah. that confirmed taking it. So Zone not out just yet. The dark stalker, you know, he has he has two stocks to work with here, but yeah, he's got so much time to do some. Oh my, oh my! Oh wow, and just stop <laughs> playing with the shield there. Down tilt jab, down tilt jab all day, but you know, zone. He's not playing around here. Yeah, tries to tries to punish the reflect, but zone able to get shield up in time here. Yeah. Again, this looks like dark stalker's game to lose, right? But zone yeah. is playing this neutral very, very well. Yeah, you know, off, after that. That SD with the miss tech, you know, he's not, he just doesn't want to let it shake him up too much, just wants to continue playing how he was before. So he jumps back on stage, doesn't get punished for him, catches when he the gets jump. That, that high up air could have taken it there if it was a DI check, but, you know, Dark Silk is still staying in it there, and now the down throw into, ooh, goes for an air dodge reach there, it seems, but not quite taking it. That dash attack sent him off now. But Darkstalker still, you know, needs to find a way oh to come God. back, even if he has the lead. Zone's still going to be applying that pressure. That neutral air covering his landing. Now Darkstalker. Oh, and he's ready to punish that power dunk. Yeah, Dark Stalker. I feel like Zone's reading the fact that Darkstalker is air dodging to stage, but he's struggling to adapt to it. And, and, and it's difficult as well because Terry's options out of that spot dodge are just much stronger than some of the other characters. Oh wow, and both were showing off their down tilts there, but yeah. Zone, you know, just going straight for the dash attack, you know. You know, Darkstalker, oh, and then there we go, okay. the back air coming oh, out, yes, and now, you know, big percent lead for Darkstalker, but Zone is, oh, and that, is that going to take it? Uh, that yet. fresh power dunk, but not not quite yet. Zone with 151 here. Right. He, he just needs to get sneezed on and he's dead for it. Yeah, he needs to be careful, and, and, and pretty much any move from Darkstalker. Any of his kill, and there it is. Just runs up, burn knuckles, zone chocolate there. But you know, you know, he's, he's still got what, what game of peace here, and he's sitting in winners. So you know, he's just gonna take that game, adapt further, and see what he can do. But you know, Darkstalker putting a game on the board there. So you know, yeah. the comeback is uh, definitely yeah, it's, what, it's, more and more it's, it's one of them in it where it's like sometimes you need a bit of a lucky break, right? And that air dodge, uh, the air dodge, the uh, stage spike, I'm sure, sorry. Right at the early percents, that's probably what FPS needed just to get a bit of momentum in his side. We'll see if he's able to carry that momentum into game three because, I mean, even though Zone was able to equal it up towards the end of that game two, Darkstalker for 70% of that game was looking looking nice. Yeah, you know, that, that, that game two couldn't have gone perfectly for Darkstalker, just giving him the perfect opening to, you know, put a game on the board and find some momentum in this set. For sure, for sure. Right, sticking on PS2, the classic. Now we're gonna see, is Darkstalker gonna keep the train going or is Zone gonna shut him down here? 
we're going to have to see. Keeping that stage control, not letting Terry find a way in. You know, using that nair, those aerials, just yeah. keep him at bay here. Zone spacing on his aerials is, like, immaculate, man. This guy throws out so many aerials, and you're like, you can't just keep spamming stuff like that. But yeah. he does it perfect in space, man. It does not So get good at placing them, and then also what he does after the aerial as well. Yeah, you know, He's yeah, just yeah. keeping it all safe, not overextending at all, which really makes it difficult for Darkstalker to find a way yeah. in. But ooh, looking for that up smash there at ledge would have been... Would have been That's quite it. the KO, that but I like to. that explosive flame keeping Darkstalker yeah. away and tries to get that down air, but not quite taking it. Oh, that Buster Wolf right out the gate. It's and there you go. You know, it was looking tricky there for Darkstalker, but one Buster Wolf is all you need sometimes. Yeah. Oh, and he catches. Well, sorry, he doesn't catch it. He beats the air dodge, but he's not able to catch it with something like an off smash or a dump air. Now, Getting a bit of damage stage, on man. the board, but that explosive flame so good at catching Terry. You know the way he recovers is just zone so good at placing it at the right time. Uh -huh. So not letting Darkstalker get much of a lead at all. Who tries to go for that that up B again? Yeah, we saw it before, didn't we? Yeah, we saw that before. Could be uh, interesting if he takes it like that. But zone, you know, keeping a uh, you know keeping up pressure while not overextending yet again. You know, playing as safe as he can while trying to bring this back. Okay. Good trade that for Darkstalker, he's able to keep ledge. Yeah, he's got that stage control now. No, trying to get something started here. Down so. throw into, doesn't get the back air. Not gonna be able to confirm. But even then, zone with the advantage there here, but just power Ooh. dunk straight through it. Big power it. dunk there. Now he's got more stage control here to work with and he's just trying to, that jab, and you know, doesn't get the jab, but that pressure on the shield, you know, it's a tricky situation for uh, zone. That power dunk's just gonna blow him up anyways. But now Zone is to find a way and ooh, tries good, to get that down there, but great recovery. Yeah, just keeping it low and you know just under the radar there. Not letting Zone get that down there as we've seen him get before in their sets. Big you know, DI mix up there from uh, DS to keep the stock and now he's got go with center stage. This becomes uh, like a boss fight. This is difficult. <laughs> but yeah. This is a good a position, but you know, Zone not letting him get a chance to really put that go meter to use, keeping him away. But Darkstalker is tacking on the percent slowly but surely. Tries to catch that power, guys. I'm probably waiting, seeing how Zone would uh, teleport ledge cancel there, but he goes far to the other side. But Darkstalker still making it back from the depths of hell, not letting Zone get rid of him just yet. You know, Darkstalk is looking to close it right now as he has the go. He doesn't want Zone bringing this one back. Oh, when he try tries to go for a power guys of a Zone, ready for it. Back airing him off stage. And there it is again. Darkstalk going a bit too high yeah, with the up B. And of course, Zone ready with the down air that time. Now, how does Zone get off ledge here? Just yeah, throwing out so many options. That ledge hang, very good yeah, for Palutena because do. he doesn't get hit by that down tilt. But, you know, he has to make a move if he wants to win this game. But, you know, but here we go. We're seeing the damage come this out from strong. Zone now. This is Explosive so flame. Look at this advantage state. This is insane. And just like that, the margin is just closed. The ultra you know. zone has been activated, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. And that power dunk not fully connecting. And this is a tricky situation here. An even game indeed. But... Yeah. Zone is not slowing down at all against Darkstalker here. He wants to just keep the pressure on board. But oh, he oh, read it again! F smash on the roll! That would have been an insane read from Darkstalker, but now you know, he's got go to Terra work does with. not want to commit at all. Oh, oh no! and that guy's are catching the landing. And not like this. Just what? an insane. I mean, that hitbox is just crazy. <laughs> I mean, you know, you it's think huge, usually bro. when you're looking for a, you know, you're punished to get landing, you think, okay, I'll be down here. Surely I won't get hit up here. Uh, but, well. <laughs> you know, Darkstalker just timing that power geyser perfectly and not giving Zone a chance to land. And uh, just like that, two to one, yeah. you know, if Darkstalker yes, takes this away. next one, it's, you know, it's a big old reset. Uh huh. Much to the chagrin of all of the TRs watching who wanted this tournament to finish before 11 o'clock, we might be seeing a grand final reset. We shall see that Darkstalker is still a game away from doing so. We'll see if Zone can take the series to get five. Yeah, for Zone, you know, he was definitely bringing that one back there. We saw in that last stop, just getting a bunch of damage, that, you know, explosive flame or a rare call. He has the means to bring it back, but Darkstalker isn't letting him take these games. Big change up from the pre-O in winner's finals. And oh, yeah, 100%. 
Dark Souls oh, is ready. Oh, he's charging up that <laughs> right, down smash. The whole move. That right leg is just ready to fling <laughs> open right it's there. Glowing. But, um, you know, Zone just playing it calm here, not letting him get anything too crazy. Oh, uh, yeah, like the Tomahawk. Can't get the back air. Good mix up again from Dark Soccer. Dash attack going to put him in a tricky position here, but. Back third, not going to do it. Punishes that nair perfectly with back throw. Oh. And there it is, with another side B. Barely not killing there. Darkstalk with max rage and yeah, go this online. Is now, this is, I mean, yeah, this is always a scary situation when you're playing. Yeah, and there the it is again the jump, you know, so good at getting out of a situation. But when he has power geyser in his disposal, it's just, it's just insane. Oh, and oh, no, doesn't no, quite jump. manage to make it back there. Not sure if he was, uh, if he expended his resources too much, but. Yeah, back to an even game. You know, if you're zone, you're gonna take that. You don't want to deal with that go meter too much. But you know, Dark Souls are firing right back, not slowing down at all with these combos. Yeah, okay. both of these characters, you know, using their nares to try and out of shield and control the pace. But you know, Dark Souls are looking for a way to get get this stop. Trying to find a comp uh, confirm off the nair there, it seems, but Zone sneaking in that back air. Down tilt doesn't connect, that's big. But he's off stage again. Yeah, Zone's so good at covering you. If the down tilt doesn't hit, he's going to get that roll with the grab. He's going to get that jump with the up air. He's going to try and find an answer to any option that Darkstalker has. But Darkstalker yeah. there, and then double down tilt into the Buster Wolf. You know, you know, when he has that go online, he just needs one key yeah. moment to yep. find the confirm. Yeah. Yeah, it's such a difficult position because obviously Ferret was so worried about getting caught by his jump, like with his jump again by that power gazer. And then, I don't know, man, it's looking like Dog Soccer's game to lose with the go at 134%. Yeah, that Ooh, was more great reaction there to the tech on the platform. Gets the back air, and now you know, he does have a bit of a percent lead, but Dog Soccer has to be careful because again, Palu. Zone so good at getting that early damage, and now it's pretty wow. much an even what game. Lead. Close the gap there, and now Zone has to find a way because if he loses this game, it's going to be a big reset. And then Zone, you want to try and just close what? this out. This like, guy's advantage there goes absolutely Ooh, nuts sometimes. Oh that dear. Charge oh up dear. Smash there. Has to be careful now because ah. Go is online, <laughs> and he like doesn't want to get hit by yet another. Power guys, and we've seen Darkstalker put that to such good use oh in this God, set. He committed so oh, that hard was... with that down there, he didn't need to do it. You know, that, that was good from Darkstalker, shortening oh, the distance of the side B. They're so... just jumping menacingly. <laughs> I can't do something. You know, if you're zone right now, you're feeling the pressure. <laughs> this is so big. Zone needs this game, bro. This is scary. Oh, and he's fishing that Buster Wolf, that explosive flame, both characters. Ah, oh, oh, and he trades the Buster Wolf there oh, with the right. bear. And that's. That spike from the power dunk. Oh, that's oh, gonna be then, it. Oh, a what snipe a there with the explosive flame. He caught him zone, sleeping. not out of it just yet. You know, he wants to. He doesn't want to reset. He wants this nah, tournament one ASAP. Not. He caught him snoozing a little bit there. That was smart from yeah, zone. Yeah, I mean, so much pressure coming out from Darkstalker there, but zone, you know, just finding the perfect time to just throw the dart and throw that explosive flame yep. there and just, you know, got a bullseye right there. Uh -huh. So now we're going to be seeing a game five in this first set. If Zone takes this, he's got first place today. If Darkstalker takes it, then we're going to be seeing a big old reset. We're going to see the reset. We'll see. We'll see. This is a very, could, very close set. Could go either way. You know, we'll see, like we said from earlier, Darkstalker changing up his game plan, really being calculated with that aggression. So we're seeing a big change up from winners' finals. But, you know, Zone is no, he's not shy from adapting at all as well. No, We've seen how well not. this guy can adapt to his opponent. And you see it here, right? He's just throwing out as many of these options as he can, like at this range. Seeing how Dark Stalker approaches and push in that way. Yeah, exactly. At, at a time like this, Zone, he doesn't want to overextend at all. He's more than happy to throw his projectiles where he can and not let Dark Stalker cook up anything crazy. There, off stage, we're going to see a forward tilt. We gets that forward tilt. No jump. And that's going to oh, hurt. This might have helped me. Terry yeah, in a no bad jump. position right now. Even if he makes it back, that's a lot of damage for Zone on the board. Sneaks in that forward air and that explosive flame. Just putting on pressure. You know, even if it doesn't hit, it's got Darkstalker in a bad position. Even if he manages to make it back. So much damage on the board, but you know. Look it's not worth man. unless like, the stock is taken and Darkstalker at 161 now. 
he's going to be trying to put this rage to work, but that dash attack barely not KOing there. Yeah, he barely is, makes uh, it back there with the input up B. This is looking very, very strong from Zone Man. Yeah. Look at that. You see that control of the space from Zone? Just yeah. any approach Dark Slipper tries to throw out, he's there ready to answer right away. And Zone, you know, playing this pretty comfortably now. But, you know, the pressure is still on. He doesn't want to get too comfortable. Drop zone? Yeah, we got Ooh, we're going to tries to go with that, that crack shoot again. Tries That's to take it the same tech. way he did in, uh, in game two, I believe. But, um, you know, Zone is just ready to play this accordingly. Not letting Dark Souls get anything started. Yeah, Lovely back for it there. Yeah, now we're back in that situation we saw a lot in winners' finals where Zone has got a pretty, pretty sizable game. And this, for that it's, power it's, on, it's on Dark Stone to do something here. Yeah, only a miss. 66 on Zone's first stock. And Zone's working up with Dark Stalker's second stock right now. Getting a nair to back here there. Putting damage on the board, keeping him off stage. But now Dark Stalker with a bit of stage control himself now. Trying to get Monkey Knight in a miss input with the down smashes there. But Zone is just putting the pressure on right now. Yeah, zone, zone is just playing so strong, man. And when you're playing like this, as concentrated and as defensively sound as this, it's so difficult to put down. It's so difficult to beat. I don't know how Dog Stone gets back into this, to be honest. He needs something big when it's going down. Yeah. He needs to take the stock, and he needs to get something big on the second stock as well. But he needs gets to take the Buster stock. Wolf sending across stage, but Zone, one of those players is really hard to make him sweat. You know, yeah, it, yeah. no matter what the situation, Keeps it cool, calm, and collected. But you know, Dark Stalk, he needs to find a way to fire it up and apply that pressure. Yeah, and there we go. The jump. Catches that landing with the, uh, the power geyser there. And you know, we've seen during this set, Dark Stalk applying the pressure with those, uh, you know, when he has go online. He needs to really find a way to abuse it as much as he can so he can turn this around. Yeah, Virat just does not want to overcommit here. Oh, trying to catch the dump there with the up air, but covering that with the dash attack. Not giving Darkstalker a chance to come back, but finds a way in with that crack shoot. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, this is where, you know, so you, you, you want to sit back with your moves. You know, you don't want to overextend. You want to punish only what you know you can, because otherwise Darkstalker is just going to start Darkstalk cooking up your stop. Right? And there we go. Catches the roll yet again. That's zone. big. That's really, really yeah. big in this. Now. Once he's got that out of the way, it's the same situation from the first stop to now. He's just going to keep a steady lead and not let Darkstalker bring this back. But... He's getting this damage, and this is yeah, not yeah. good for Darkstalker right now. Yeah, I told you. This is, uh, again, certainly not insurmountable by Darkstalker. It literally just takes a couple of confirms and he's got the stock here. But again, Virat, he's playing very, very strong. He's finding just working around Darkstalker's offense so well, not really letting him get anything started. You know, Darkstalker's looking for oh a way God. to get this. This might be it here. Yeah. This might be it. No. Oh, tries, tries to go over the there. drop zone there, but doesn't quite find it. Oh my god, he's got a bit of a risky Buster Wolf there, but unpunished. But he's getting that back at Darkstalker on his tournament stock right now. Again, just overcommits with the down air. Uh, you gotta yeah. hope that doesn't cost him the game. You've yeah. gotta hope. Zone oh just really dear. wants to get this stock out the way while he still can. But, you know, oh, Dark Stalker, right. he's not going to stop fighting until it's over. He's got that power geyser. He's got that Buster Wolf. He's ready to throw it out when he needs to. Zone really needs to be careful, even though he has this lead. That's such a good catch of Dark Stalker. Oh, Amazing oh, catch of the jump there. No, he no, he no. This, this is where it gets a bit scary. Zone needs to find a way to take this stock, or else Dark Stalker is oh, going to make God. one hell of a comeback. This is so, so scary for Zone. Even at 160%, it takes literally anything. Oh, oh, and that, he's just guy, waiting for that this roll. This guy is cold. This guy is wow. cold. <laughs> just sitting there that with his the back to That was the coldest him. back throw I have seen in my life. He was just Bro, there. He was like, he, there he was like I know you want to roll. I know you want to roll. Just do it. And then he just just punishes because that pressure could have back aired, could have F-tilt. But no, God, he was just like. Ice. He, ice in the veins. Very very cold and calm <laughs> gameplay from Zone. And there we go, 3-2 over Darkstalker. I, I feel like we need to clarify, that was game five against a Terry with Rage and Go. He stood me back to him. It was just like, you're gonna roll in. That's what I'm you're saying. You're gonna you know, that, roll in. Oh, you've rolled in, sick. Yeah. <laughs> That's Situation so like that where, That's you know, so any, any normal player would just be, you know, quaking in their boots, but Zone is just there. He's just like, I'm just gonna wait. 
I'm just going to wait, God, I'm going to grab you, and I'm going to throw you. The and he just zone. deals with it in amazing fashion there. Zone taking it 3-2 over Darkstalker, yeah, and uh, to him. Getting, getting a big dub today, uh, a meltdown. Yeah, so your top three, Firat, Zone with the first place finish, Darkstalker, commiseration to him, put up a very, very good fight in that grand final set, uh, getting second place, and NS with the third place finish. I, yeah. think, I think we're probably wrapping up at this point. We're talking still. Yeah. <laughs> but no, great, great performances oh, from uh, all, all of top eight today, and you know, zone just really highlighting like you know that that calm gameplay. You know, not not overextending, even in the most you know scary scenarios with Go Terry and all that rage. You know, he's just gonna play it calm and deal with it accordingly, and that's you know that's why he's today's winner. Yep, hundred percent. Well, uh, it's been a pleasure casting as much as I have yep, for you today, Kuro. It was nice. For sure, my guy. You, my guy. Uh, thank you all for watching. Make sure you follow, subscribe, all that fun stuff to VGBC. Uh, I'm Dev. Um, I'm probably not going to commentate much. <laughs> hey man, thanks for joining I'll us. I'll be around, though. hopefully. We'll see. Definitely a joy commentating this grand final set with you today. And thanks again, of course, to all the viewers watching that Monday Meltdown tonight. Be sure to follow that team and VG Bootcamp. And uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. Yes. Peace out, folks.